Happy, Happy Valentine's, Valentine's Day, Day, Hoyas! Today we're showing y'all Hoyas with high SAT scores and all things carnations. Also, Blake and Ethan's love story along with all the students of the day this week. So, let's get things started. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Harrison's Blue Crew. I'm Raymond Calero. And I'm Holland Touchstone. Raymond, are you excited about Valentine's Day? You know you can love more than just people, just like I love studying. Well, clearly so do these kids, and they have the SAT scores to prove it. All right, Sarah, Beth, and Whitney have us covered with the segment. Let's roll it. The PSAT uh, is, is a test obviously that 10th graders take, but 9th graders here take it as well as juniors. Um, I think it's a good, not necessarily an indicator of how well the students are going to do, but it does give them the sort of that experience of what the SAT is going to be like. You know, I think by 9th, 10th, and even 11th graders taking it, it's good practice for the SAT that junior and senior year when it really counts. So I think there's something we said about studying hard, but also studying smart, using that time well, um, especially when it comes to the SAT. Uh, the three different parts of the SAT that you have to master. Um, when I got my PSAT scores back, I was not too happy with them. They were pretty low, so I did extra studying online, and I ended up increasing my scores on the actual SAT. To prepare for the SAT, I went online, took a bunch of practice tests, got myself a tutor, and I go with him every Wednesday to get a higher score. Uh, I've taken the SAT four times. My parents were excited I got a great score on the SAT, but I was more excited that I beat my sister at getting a good score on the SAT. If you want to sign up for the SAT, go to collegeboard.com and follow the enrollment instructions. Are you interested in working or running a business one day? Well, I'd expect you'd be interested in the business career tech pathway. You will learn valuable information such as proper business etiquette and how to use programs in Microsoft Office. By taking the pathway, you'll also get in-school opportunities like working at the hole in the wall. Additionally, for any students who have taken Intro to Business and Technology class already, they are eligible to sign up for the Financial Literacy class available next school year. Many students definitely felt the love this past Wednesday with the Carnation deliveries. Oh yes we did. How many did you get, Holland? Well, I got none. It's extremely unfortunate. I got two. Okay then, Lauren and Roma have the complete inside look on all things Carnations. <laughs> Hey Hoyas, as you know, we gave out carnations this past Wednesday, so let's take a look at what had to happen for it and what it means to the people behind it. So French Club sells carnations so you can tell your friends you appreciate them around Valentine's Day or a significant other. Everyone is very thankful and, and also there's always some, you know, um, an unexpected surprise that is always heartwarming. One particular student in particular was having a hard time at home and we went ahead and sent you know three carnations to this person and it made their day, it made their week just to know that someone was out there supporting them and thinking of them. I think people like giving them more than receiving them I'd like to think. It's really really a cool thing that we do here and uh, yeah everyone loves it. Glad y'all got to see what carnations were all about. Hope you have a great day, Hoyas. Holland, did you hear about the guy that got his girlfriend a hundred carnations? A hundred? That's way too overwhelming for me. Well, let's hope they can learn the boundaries of love with this message from Ethan and Blake. Hey, look what I got. Chocolates? No, those aren't just any ordinary chocolates. Those are the love chocolates. We'll make some love chocolates. Well, let's just say whatever it says under the chocolate comes true. Wait, there's, there's no way this works. You don't believe me. See for yourself. Chick magnet? Chick magnet. Chick <laughs> Your turn, bro. All right. Let's go for the middle. For romance. Oh, 
What else could be in here? Stood up. Stood what if up. you get taller? I want to get stood. Both of us need that. Hold on, bro. I gotta make an important call. Hello. Hey, what's up? Um, are we on for tonight still? Dinner? Dinner? No. Tonight? Oh. Yeah, I don't think I can tonight. Okay. All right, no, it's fine. I'm so sorry. All right, I'll see you later. Bye. That's never happened before. I guess I'll do the last one. I'll do the honors. If you get a good one, I'm gonna be a little upset. Love comes true. Blake, where'd you go, man? I had to blow off some steam. Oh my God, Ethan! Oh hey, uh, what's that? What are you? Alright, on a real note. Happy Valentine's Day from Ethan and I. See you later, boys. I wonder where I can buy those chocolates. I don't think love should come that easy. Just like how it's not as easy to make student of the day. Congratulations to the student of the day winners from Monday to Friday. Avery Visage, Jordan Jones, Jamani Fenderson, Natara Connolly, and Megan Kimball. Also, as y'all know, it's Black History Month and we're doing a question of the day on Hoya Broadcasting. All you have to do is scan this code and if you are the first one to get it right, you get a prize. Thank you so much for tuning in to Hoya Vision Blue Crew and make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Hoya Vision TV. And from all of us here, we hope you have an awesome February break and a happy Valentine's Day. Once again, I'm Holland Touchstone. And I'm Raymond Calra. See, See you after, after break, break Hoyas. Hoyas.